not terrible like it has been oh, in the past. Oh, exactly. And it's not going to get as humid or as hot as it was when we had that real big heat wave just a couple of weeks ago. But we are going to turn it up just a little bit. Take a look at Greensboro today. We're helping hands more out there. A lot of folks getting outdoors today. Mostly sunny skies, temperatures in the upper 80s. Real close to 90 this afternoon. We're sitting at 78 degrees right now. Humidity is at 64%, which at this hour in the summer is actually not that bad. Our dew point at 65. Temperatures overnight should get down into the mid to upper 60s. You've got 70 degrees in Martinsville. It's warm in Asheboro at 75. The highs this afternoon did make it to 90 or hotter in Danville, Winston-Salem, Martinsville up to 91, Mount Airy up to 88. And it was officially 89 degrees at PTI Airport in Greensboro, 88 is the average so pretty close to norm. We'll get a little bit above that Monday and Tuesday and temperatures should stay in the upper 80s for a large part of this week. We do have rain chances coming back, so nothing on Monday or Tuesday across the triad. There will be a chance of rain along the mountain ridges every day this week. Wednesday and Thursday, that's when the rain chances go up for the triad. 30% Wednesday late in the day, 50% scattered showers and thunderstorms around on Thursday into Friday. Friday. You can see the radar is pretty quiet out there right now. In fact, no rain and really not much in the way of cloud cover. It should be mostly clear overnight. There'll be a little bit of fog up against the mountains. We don't have to worry about a storm threat tonight. That's going to stay north and west of us up over Iowa, where you can see that line of showers and storms approaching Kansas City. Otherwise, how high pressure across the southeast means we'll have more sun in our forecast tomorrow. We'll start with temperatures closer to 60 degrees in the mountains, mid to upper 60s across the triad. And then as we go through the day, by lunchtime, we're already into the mid to upper 80s. And then tomorrow afternoon, we are flirting with 90. And yeah, there will be at least some clouds kind of building in the mountains and at least a spotty shower or storm. Temperatures climb during the day tomorrow up to 90 on average in the triad. Southwest wind about 5, 10 miles an hour. National Black Theater Festival, of course, is getting on this week. We've got heat a little bit humid tomorrow afternoon, staying hot, and during the evening hours, a bit muggy. You will notice that. Greensboro grasshoppers, they will be at home as well with temperatures that are in the mid 80s early on for the later innings. You don't have to worry about thunderstorms tomorrow, so it's a great night at the ballpark. Foothills up to 87 tomorrow afternoon, so it's going to be hot as well in Mount Airy, North Wilkesboro. Up into the mountains we go with a high of close to 80 degrees. Scattered showers and thunderstorms pop up. I don't expect to see a whole lot out there, but there'll at least be a chance. By Tuesday, you can see this is a pretty dry map too, all the way down to the coast and over to the mountains. By Tuesday afternoon, we're doing a little bit of the showers and storms building from the mountains from Asheville up toward Boone. We'll keep that rain chance in for late in the day. Next weather system is this front that is way out to the north and west, so it doesn't carry with it a huge threat of severe weather, but it will bring in the likelihood of more rain and even a chance for a few thunderstorms coming our way toward the end of the week. So if you look at the map here, this will show you Wednesday. I do think mountains, foothills, you're going to see some showers and thunderstorms. We may get some of the triad by afternoon. Thursday right now looks also like we'll have showers and storms right along that front. So when we look at the seven day forecast, you are going to see rain chances at about 50% on Thursday and Friday. And then we're going to keep at least a few storms around. It looks like moving into this weekend, but temperatures should be a little cooler. All right, Laney, thank you so much. The stars are shining bright in Winston Salem. We'll take you inside tonight's celebrity reception ahead of the National Black Theater Festival when we come back. Stay with us.